The high concentration of nitrogen within the polyon granule is activated by the presence of water. It only takes a minimal amount of moisture to start the osmotic process for the release of nutrients to occur from the polyon granule. Studies have confirmed that soil moisture levels as low as 6% were sufficient to activate the polyon granules. This level of soil moisture would be considered to be less than the permanent wilting point for most plants. After the initial activation, water is not required for the release of nutrients. Within a week, the nutrients begin to move out of the granule through the polyon membrane. This osmotic process allows for the constant, gradual diffusion of nutrients through the polymer coating. The temperature at the soil turf interface where the polyon granule lies affects the nutrient diffusion rate. The warmer the temperature, the faster the nutrient release. The thickness of the polymer coating determines how long the osmotic process will take before all of the nutrients have been released. The process could last up to a year depending on the thickness of the polymer coating. Once the polyon capsule is empty, native soil microbes begin to decompose the capsule, releasing carbon dioxide, ammonium, and water.